Hey everyone, today we have this 2023 Ford Explorer ST. It is in carbonized gray. The ST is the Highline sports package from Ford, giving you all kinds of performance features. Let's check it out together. So the biggest performance feature is right under the hood. It is a three liter twin turbo V6 engine, putting out 400 horsepower. Made it to a 10 speed automatic transmission. Definitely have lots of jam to get around town in this one. You've also got these great LED automatic set it and forget it headlights and LED fog lights to go with those it even has auto high beam so you really don't have to worry about turning anything on or off when it comes to parking this thing is a pro it gives you front park sensors as well as an around view camera system so if you get too close to something in the garage those sensors are gonna beep of you and you'll be able to see it in that camera the ST in the front grille does let you know this is the performance package and it comes with a performance driving uh, experience from Ford so you can go down to to their test track to let you take one of their STs out and really show you how to move around the track with it. The vehicle also has a forward collision system with pedestrian detection. So if somebody walks out in front of you last minute, it's gonna put on the brakes that saves lives and saves you some money on insurance. 20 inch high gloss wheels look great with the red calipers peeking out the back. Nice high power disc brakes there. We've got blacked out mirrors. The mirrors have the LED signal light in them. They are also a power folding heated memory mirror with a blind spot system in them. That lights up when someone's in your blind spot. To get in or out of this one, you can just put your code in here. It'll uh, unlock that. You can also press these two bottom to lock it. You can see my mirror power fold in. You can put your hand inside here. It'll sense the heat from my hands and unlock. Or again, we can press this to lock it up. You can also use this key fob, which has unlock, lock, remote start, power lift gate, and alarm. Or you can download the Ford Pass app and do that anywhere in the world from your phone for free. Thank you, Ford. You also have tinted windows, which look great. Up top, you do have the uh, roof rail holders here. So that is an option on the ST and a really nice one to get right from factory. Open up the back door and you'll see your gorgeous ST interior. Love the accent stitching on the leather. In the back, you also have shades for the sun if you've got little ones and sensitive eyes. Nice piano black gloss uh, touches on the interior. And the seats are nice and easy to wipe down. These rear seats are heated and that's your rear controls. And you also have rear climate control as well as USB and full household plug plug-ins there. If you look up top, you'll see a huge panoramic roof with power shade, which is partially closed right now. And this does have the captain's chairs configuration. You can also get a bench. When we come to the back of the vehicle, you'll see we've got more park sensors as well as a backup camera. It does have a trailer tow hitch, which is capable of pulling 5,600 pounds. Quad tipped exhaust that looks great. And if we hit this opener for us, you can see the cargo space. So it does have third row seat that is laid down right now and you can see all kinds of room back there. If we go ahead and hit this button right here, it's gonna power those up for us nice and easy. There's also a little bit more storage underneath here, which is nice. And again, if we wanna put those down, just hit the button and those will go down for us. I love how easy that is. Let's go to the front of the vehicle, check out some of those features. So we open up the driver's door and you can see we've got controls for our memory functions, power locks, power folding mirrors, power windows. It does have a Bang & Olufsen stereo system. That's thanks to the technology package this one has. It says Ford Performance when you open the door. Also at night, it shines right on the ground under your mirror, an ST logo. That looks pretty cool. We've got nice trim on our dash, our set and forget it headlights, your fog light switch, power lift gate, interior dimmer switches. And to open the hood, you actually just pull that twice so there's no hood lever. Then you do have power tilt and telescopic steering, which is on memory. On the end of your signal light switch, there is a button I like to point out here. That's for the lane departure system. Nice and easy to turn that on and off. Then you have these heated and cooled 10-way adjustable front seats. Uh, again, really stylish, and they definitely hug you with a bit of bolstering there. Let's climb inside. Okay, now that we're inside the vehicle, we're gonna go ahead and hit this button. That's gonna power everything up for us. Nice full digital display here. It has a digital speedometer and a bunch of other readouts, including a, a, a camera system that takes a picture of the road signs as you go past, so you can tell what speed you're supposed to be at for the speed limit. Then on our steering wheel, we've got the cruise control. Now this cruise control is adaptive and intelligent. That means it'll slow you down with the vehicle in front of you 
and can even slow you down or speed you up with the speed limit signs. It also has Ford's semi-autonomous driving system known as lane centering. If you turn that on, it'll even steer the steering wheel for you using the lanes on the road. Really handy on longer drives. Volume controls to your stereo. On this side, controls to that digital display, voice recognition and phone controls. This leather wrapped steering wheel is heated. Feels like a warm cup of coffee first thing in the morning. Nice ST logo on the bottom there as well. Then you have this huge touch screen, which is the upgraded screen in this vehicle. Um, really nice configuration with your navigation and all your SYNC 4 technology. Love the SYNC 4. Uses wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, so this can turn into your phone. Um, basically give you all your apps up here, things like your maps from your phone, your Spotify, uh, podcasts, audiobooks, all those kind of things, which is just great. We can hit this button down below, brings up our all around parking, which you can take a look at some different views. Then if we do want to turn our park sensors on and off easy, you use this button, four way flashers, stereo controls. Then we come down to the climate control system where we do have our heated seats, heated steering wheel and air conditioned seats, dual climate control. Uh, then you can go into the menu if you'd like, bring anything up top, or you can access your rear control panel and start controlling what the rear of the vehicle does climate wise. Open this up and you do have your USB and USB-C as well as a 12 volt power supply. Rotary style shifter with a manual mode. And if you hit the M, you can shift using these paddle shifters right behind the steering wheel to go up or down through the gears. Electronic park brake, auto hold. If you don't know what auto hold does, if you turn this on, it's gonna keep the vehicle from free rolling when you take your foot off the brake. When you had a set of lights or a stop sign, really nice feature. Then we do have this uh, engine auto off control, traction control, as well as downhill descent control. So if you're going down a steep hill, this is gonna keep you from going down, again, free rolling down that hill. Drive modes, if we turn this dial and look in the digital display, we can go and take a look at some different settings. So we can go to Eco, Sport, or Trailer Tow. Those are three different settings that you can use for the engine parameters. Go the other direction, we can go to Slippery, Trail, or deep snow and sand, and that all mitigates the vehicle's four-wheel drive system. Then you do have a wireless charger right here, which is nice. Open this up, and you've got a little bit of an upper and lower section in here with another 12-volt power supply. Come up top, you have an electrochromatic auto-dimming mirror. We've got some map lights here. We've got our power sunroof control and power shade control. Speaking of shades, open this up. That's where you put your sunglasses and to round it all out, garage door openers up on the visor. That's this beautiful 2023 Ford Explorer ST. Thanks a lot for taking a look at this video. Do me a huge favor, click subscribe to this channel. If you wanna see more videos like it, go ahead and hit that bell icon. You'll be notified every time I make a video. And if you like this one, give it a big thumbs up. Thanks everybody.